So the last part of the test suite that we're going to want to add is assertions. So assertions is just the validation point. So assertion is what actually does the does does this value equal what I was expecting uh, sort of scenario. So to add assertions, let me close this real quick. Clean up here. All right. Open this up. So you can see that at the bottom of the request, there is this assertion uh, tab here. Uh, you're going to click on that. You're going to hit this plus button, and you're going to add assertions. So you have different categories to choose from. Uh, for now, we're going to use contains. So this is going to search for uh, text that is within the response body, so within that, that JSON. So uh, I don't remember. Let's see. For this one, re resource list berry. So berry, I remember there was 1 through 20 value. So let's, let's put in 20 and hit OK. So if we run this, you can see that the, the assertion has a green dot next to it now. So that means that uh, that assertion passed. Uh, that it was able to, SOPY was able to find the number 20 within that response. Uh, let's, let's try to change it to 21 and see what happens. So do you see now it changed to failed? Uh, because there was only 21 through 20 uh, in, the, in the berries. So it did not find 20, 21. So the assertion failed. So that's pretty it, that's pretty much it. It's pretty simple. So uh, use assertions. There's plenty of uh, assertions to choose from. So use whatever you need uh, that meets meets your needs. Uh, and the more assertions, the better, in, in my opinion. All right. So this concludes the tutorial. Uh, we have gone through how to create a SOAP, SOAP UI project, uh, how to create all the elements of it, so how to create resources, uh, methods, and requests. And from that, uh, I have shown you how to create test suites uh, that have test cases and test steps and how to add assertions.